everybody, my name is Oksana, and today is another class of English. We are going to talk about food now. Hope that today's class is going to be interesting, so I invite you to join us. Let's make a little pause and wait for the students to come. I'm waiting for all of you. Please join us. Hi, hello, Yuri, how are you? How was your day? What have I'm you been fine, doing? Fine. What have you been doing? I come today? from the badminton and I'm helping my friend in the yard. Mm -hmm. So you went to play badminton I, today, am I right? Yes, I, and I'm reading the book, English book, mm -hmm. kidnapped by Louis Stevenson. I understand. Okay. Did you win or lose a game in basketball? In uh, badminton, I... In badminton? Yes, I win. You won? So that's great. Our team, Congratulations. Our team won. Your team won. Super. Yes. So do you often play it? Often. Often? How often do you play badminton? Sometimes four, sometimes three days a week. Mm -hmm. Do you enjoy it? Yes, I think it's good for sasudas for vessels. Yes. Uh, or uh, okay, yes. <coughs> so, what are your plans? Do you want to be a professional badminton player? No. I understand. Okay. What English words have you learned today? Do you remember some of them? No, I don't remember. I don't remember. I, don't. Uh, I want to repeat them in the evening and then I want to remember. Yes, and uh, do you know the difference between repeat and revise? Revise как бы возобновить память, да? Yes, and repeat. Repeat это просто повторение за учителем. Yes, yeah, re repeat after somebody, repeat uh -huh. after the teacher, and revise the vocabulary, revise the material at home, so you know it. That's very good. The, the, the item of the, the term, the item of the lesson is food. Food, yes. Tra and tradition. you asked me, mm -hmm, traditional food, you're right, today we are talking about trans fats. Uh, do you think that it is an interesting topic to discuss or not? I think interesting because in some of food the trend. We've got it, yes. And uh, what food does usually uh, have this ingredient? Maybe uh, margarine or butter. Yes, exactly. So, cakes, maybe different, different types of fast of food products. Uh, maybe yep. ice cream, some kind of ice cream. Mm -hmm. Yes, you're right. They include this. And uh, while the students are gathering, I'd like you to revise some vocabulary first. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to say the definition and you'll try to guess the word, okay? Yes. So what is the meaning of the word? Meaning is uh, try to stay away from some somebody or something in one word. Can you guess the meaning of the word? Try to stay away from somebody or something. Stay away, try to stay away from somebody or something. Don't know. It is avoid. You know it. Avoid. Yes. yes, exactly. Not allowed in one word as a verb. Not allowed or not allowed or not nosy. Prohibit or ban. 
Yes, not when, allowed. When no, when no, when no, when not often used in your speech, this was you are not remember them. Yes, I understand. But sometimes it is good uh, to remember these words, and it's a good practice. So I hope that one day we'll try to, to do it one more. Good. And uh, here is the conversation, the first conversation, small talk practice. I'm going to share a link for you. Hello, Michael, how are you? How was your day? What have you been doing? Michael, hi. Hello. How are you? I'm fine. And you? Fine, thank you. What have you been doing today? What have you been up to? What's new? Usual working day. Do nothing. <laughs> Doing nothing. <laughs> Actually, all the time you say so, but in fact, you are very hard working. I know about it. You stay at computer day in and night and uh, <laughs> do everything that is necessary. Okay, but yes. Uh, today we are going to talk about trans fats. Do you often eat fast food or do you prefer the, uh, homemade food? Fat, uh, I, for, for me, it's not important which one uh, is food, but uh, maybe, food uh, maybe if, if you need to choose, uh, I prefer um, maybe, uh, how to say it, it's normal food. Normal food. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do you prefer to eat at home or somewhere else? Homemade. At home? What? At home, right, Yuri? Mm -hmm. It depends on the situation. I mean, mm -hmm. Sometimes I have to eat at home, sometimes I go uh, to, to the restaurants, like fast restaurants. I understand. But uh, I don't know. I don't, yeah, we have a, uh, in Kiev, we have restaurants like Ukrainian cuisine. Mm -hmm. Normal. So it's interesting, must be interesting. What about fast food? Do you often eat at fast food uh, restaurants or do you take takeaways together with you? Do you like it? Mm, uh, y y if uh, we talk about the normal, for me fast food it's like uh, a usual restaurant, uh, but uh, you have uh, uh, service uh, by, by yourself. You, you mm -hmm. have how to say it right. Uh, in this restaurant service, you can make by yourself. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, well, what about the quality of food? Do you think that uh, fast food is uh, of a good quality or not? It's normal. Yes. It's normal. It's quite normal. Quite okay. Yeah. Okay. You already agree with Michael that fast food is okay. It is normal. It is. You too, uh, eat it no, 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 I'm not. I eat very, very far. I'm not often eat this food. I think it's not so normal. It's because not. if the person eats uh, very often, uh, the cholesterol is very high. Become cholesterol. very high. Cholesterol. Become very high. Hi. Yes, I agree with you. Do you prefer homemade food? Yes, homemade. So who cooks for you? Do you or do you do the cooking yourself? I, I often do the cooking myself. Mm -hmm. What are your pref your um, dishes? That, what are the dishes that you like most of all? Uh, what are your favorite dishes? What dishes do you like to eat? Chicken dishes, maybe fish, the uh, Baked fish, baked fish. Baked fish. Uh, red borscht, maybe. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Delicious, <laughs> yummy. <laughs> well, great. Uh, Anna, hello. How are you? How was your day? Hello, thank you. My day was fine. How are the children? Are they home? Are no, they okay? They have a, a cold right now, but it uh, will be okay, right? I, I think. Mm -hmm. Today we are talking about food, healthy food and trans fats. Do you think that using trans fats in our daily life can lead to a dangerous situation with our health? Do you agree? I am um, not very. Um, I do not, do not know what is uh, this trans fats. 
trans fats, yes. So fats that are uh, not originally made, that are industrial ones. Uh, they are not uh, natural. Margarine, margarine, maybe. Margarine, yes, you're right. And the others, so uh, some superstitial uh, oils and fats that are um, produced by, uh, by our industry. They are cheap. From, they are made from coconut oil from a very cheap and uh, low sources, raw materials. And do, they think, do you think that they could uh, be dangerous for our health or not? I think uh, not um, all um, cheap things can be dangerous to our health, but um, in general it's not very healthy. Mm -hmm. Do you often, do you often uh, go to fast food restaurants or do you prefer homemade food? Uh, it's a pity, but I do love <laughs> fast food food. So do I, yes. I often go to pizza and I enjoy it and uh, sometimes I'm very sorry about myself because my stomach fails to uh, <laughs> digest everything that I eat. <laughs> it's a problem all the time. That's why I want to uh, have a research on this problem and discuss it together with you today. Well, um, do, and uh, do we have Boris or Mary to, together with us? Hello. Hi. Hi, Mary. How are you? I'm fine. How are you? Fine, thank you. Do you often go to uh, fast food restaurants or do you cook yourself at home? I cook it myself at home. What are your favorite dishes to cook? Do you like it? Do you like cooking? Mm, yes, if I have mood. Mm -hmm. Do you often have mood to cook? Uh, sometimes I I not have mood for cooking, so I cook in pasta and, or potatoes. I understand. Mm -hmm. Okay, here is the handout for you to share. Open the link, please. Click on it. Please read in warm up questions. Question number one Do you read the label on the food item before you buy it? Uh, Mary. Yes. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm read. I'm read. I read. Uh, I'm read label. I'm. Without, uh, M. Without M. I read. I read, I read label. Mm -hmm. I see date. Mm -hmm. Of production. Yes, mm -hmm. Anna, do you agree with your point of view, Anna? I have to uh, do it because I am uh, breastfeeding and uh, it's uh, not very healthy for my baby when I eat uh, some food. chemicals. Chemicals. The food, yes. Exactly. So you have to be very attentive. And, uh, but yeah, some people go to the KFC or eat pizza, so I'm not so strict okay. for that. <laughs> yes. Okay, yeah. thank you. Do you feel that food you buy at the supermarket is properly labeled? Yuri? Yes, I feel that food which I buy at the supermarket is properly labeled. Because sometimes uh, it can be outdated and uh, the date can be wrong and the other date can be put on the sometimes, product. Uh, sometimes some products are not labeled. Sometimes products are not fresh, but the label says the other, quite the other, quite the opposite. They, they're not, they're not right truth. On they do not write truth. Mm -hmm. yeah. Michael, do you often go to the supermarkets? Do you read everything that they write? Do you believe that it is true? No, uh, not so long. I am going to, 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 to the supermarket. Not so. I'm. Mm -hmm. I'm I go to the supermarket uh, not so often, and uh, uh, I try to read it, but not uh, you know, not, not every product. Because I just see, and if, if I like uh, how it looks like, I, I can buy it. If you like it, you buy it. Yeah. I understand. But, but, okay. but, but we need to see because uh, one time I uh, check uh, the date of, um, 
and and the date or what uh, mm -hmm. yes mm -hmm. uh, and uh, I find it that uh, oh. not eatable <laughs> because this date was uh, not possible mm -hmm. uh, yeah this date was a month ago mm -hmm. Yes, I agree with you completely. Once I went to the supermarket to buy some sausage, and uh, the very a very strange situation happened to me. I uh, bought the sausage and uh, brought it home. At home, I took a knife and uh, had a slice of it. But unfortunately, I found a big fly, big green fly in it. <laughs> and after that, I didn't go to the <laughs> supermarket. <laughs> I didn't go to the supermarket to buy the sausage. I have the person I trust and I buy food there, only there, because I don't know what is going to be next. So it is really dangerous to buy food in the shop that you do not know. So, so in the, in the yeah. supermarket, I uh, most of all buy porridge. Porridge, yes. Or juice or water, mm -hmm. not so, sausage, not sausage. In mm -hmm. the market, I buy, I buy sausage. So, it can be safe, but not sausage, not ready-made food. I try to avoid uh, these uh, departments uh, because <laughs> I don't know what can happen to my health uh, if uh, I buy yeah. it. Experience. <laughs> okay, so, uh, Mary, are there any types of ingredients that you try to avoid when buying food? Uh, I don't buy meat. Meat. <laughs> yes. And I try not buy uh, some snake. Sometimes I Snack. buy snacks. Snacks. Yes. snacks. Buy chips. <laughs> and so, but it's very seldom. So, so it's normal. It's okay. Good. So now I'd like you to read some facts about Benin trans fats. It's a text. Page one, open a handout and let's read it. Mm -hmm. You're welcome to be the first to start reading. In November 2004, the Parliament of Canada wanted to take action on the use, on the use of artificial trans fats in food. The government had one year to develop new standards for the food industry. Legislation forcing food producers to include trans fats on their products labels was passed earlier and became law in 2006. The Thank consumption. You. Mary, go on, please. Uh, the uh, consum consumption 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 yes. of trans uh, of trans fat is a serious health issue. Serious, serious health issue. Uh, trans fats ra uh, raises levels of bad. Cholesterol. Uh, fats or fats? Fats. Yeah, fats. Mm -hmm. fats. Uh, cholesterol and be, uh, and because the body cannot rid uh, itself uh, of these fats. 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 Uh, they collect uh, in the arter arterias yeah. and may lead uh, to heart uh, attacks and. Attacks. Ethics and uh, strokes. strokes. Then you legis legislation legislation uh, legislation 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 yeah. was I met at uh, trans fats uh, found is uh, processed food uh, foods such as uh, margarine uh, dug dug nuts, dug nuts, nuts. Uh, instant uh, sub subs, cake uh, mixes and frozen pizzas. pizzas yes thank you well done good of you uh, Anna go on please mm -hmm. The task force made up of people from the food industry, universities, and the Heart and Stroke Foundation was set up to suggest ways to remove or reduce trans fats from Canadian diets. Yes, thank you, Michael. Go on, please. Maybe uh, <coughs> Anna, try to read the next one, and I, I will do it. Okay. Anna, if you like, you can read. Okay. Uh, not everyone was in favor of this election. Some par parliamentarians think 
that the government should not decide what people can or cannot eat. Food industry spokespeople say the trans fats may have been replaced with other, perhaps equally unhealthy, substances. 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 Others were concerned that the current levels of these foods might be disturbed because without trans fats they could not stay on grocery shelves uh, for as long. For as long. Thank you, Valtan. Uh, Michael, go on, please. Okay. Uh, however, several food manufacturers such as uh, uh, Wortman. Wortman Cookies, uh, Kellogg's, uh, and uh, McCain's uh, began to, to reduce or remove trans fats from the products uh, voluntarily. Voluntarily. Yes. Uh, this uh, was mainly due to pressure. Pressure from uh, consumers and health authorities. Authorities, yes. Good, well done. Thank you. So, uh, what does it mean to vote, Yuri? No, sorry. Yes, artificial trans fats. Yes, legislation. Yes, what is legislation? It's uh, the laws, special laws. Laws, special laws, regulations, right? Arteries. Arteries. Heart attacks and strokes. Uh, yes, you're right. Uh, parliamentaries, uh, parliamentarians. Parliament. Yes, you're right. Good. And question number one What did the Canadian Parliament do in November 2004? Yuri, this is for you. Um, the Canadian Parliament uh, voted to take action of the use of artificial trans fats in food. Yes, you're right. Thank you. Well done. Next question, number two. Mary, what did the legislation aim to do? Uh, legislation forcing food producer to include trans fat on their produce uh, lab labels. Yes. Okay, labels. Good. What do some food industry sp uh, spokespeople say about banning trans fats, Anna? Mm, not everyone was in favor. Some spokespeople uh, think that uh, people uh, sh that the government should not decide what people can or cannot eat. Yes, exactly. You're yeah, right. Thank you. Why is the consumption of trans fats a serious health issue, Mary? Because it uh, may may to it may it may lead a heart attack or stroke, because heart attacks and strokes exactly. and cancer. And cancer sometimes. Yes, you're right. Good vocabulary review. Match the words on the left with the correct meaning on the right. The first word is parliament. Yuri, you're welcome. What is the Parliament. definition? Parliament. Parliament. Uh, uh, a legislative assembly in certain countries. Yes, exactly. To vote or a vote. And uh, you're welcome. What is it? To. So to express yes. One yes, you're right. To express preference for a proposed resolution of an issue. You're right. Mm. Next one, artificial, Mary. Uh, artificial eats something. Mm -hmm. Something. Uh, is good in it. I don't yes, know. you're right. Made an imitation or something natural. Yes, but yes. In fact, it is not natural. Trans fats. Uh, Michael, you're welcome. Trans fats, number four. Okay, I see. Uh, maybe it's uh, uh, F. You're right. Uh, F and unsaturated fatty acid. Rated. You're right. Okay. Good. Uh, legislation. N is a missing. Right? Legislation. Yuri? A, propos a proposed of a next law or group of laws. OK. 
Okay, it is E, right? E. Good. Arteries. Mary, you're welcome, number six. Arteries is. Oh, uh, oh no. I can I I know this word but I can can't find it. Yes. Yeah. Just read the uh, tubes uh, that carry that blood, blood, blood from our heart to our, to our cells, uh, the organs. Organs. What is all? Uh, oh yes, I I'm I know. Good, good. Stroke. Yuri, you're welcome. What is stroke? Stroke. Stroke. Stroke is uh, maybe um, made of inimitation. No. No, it is the disease, right? The state of health. It's a condition Pardon? due to a lack of oxygen to the brain. A stroke. A condition due to a lack of oxygen. Mm -hmm. to the oxygen? Brain. Do you know the, the term oxygen? What is it? Kislarot. Kislarot, yes. Yeah. Next one, uh, Anna, you're welcome. Parliamentarians, number eight. Such a long word. Number eight. It is actually B, a member of parliament, right? Mm -hmm. Heart attack, Michael, what is heart attack? The last one, number nine. Uh, heart attack. Uh, heart attack. Uh, 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 Sudden interruption of the supply of blood to the heart. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It is heart attack. So, a little bit difficult, but still, you've coped with it. It is very good. Exercise B, choose the right words from the left column above to complete the following sentences. We have to fill in the gaps. Number one, and now you're welcome. Anna is absent. Yes, Yuri. Jim recently suffered a uh... a stroke. A stroke. The so stroke. A stroke is connected with our brain, and a heart attack. It is about heart, right? So a stroke. The doctor said the blood supply to his brain was interrupted. Yes. Stroke. Good. Number two, uh, uh, Mary. Sarah lost her leg in a car accident. I hope she has an uh, uh, artificial, artificial, artificial leg. Artificial leg. Exactly. You're right. Number three, Michael. You're welcome. Number three, uh, the, uh, it, the Canadian Parliament. Uh, Canadian Parliament recently uh, voted. Latest. Recently voted. Voted yes. To uh, ban trans fats. Trans fats from all foods sold in Canada. In Canada. Good. Question for discussion. Number one. Do you think food manufacturers are doing enough to warn people about the risks of certain ingredients? Mary, what's your point of view? Do they say everything about the products they produce for us? What about no. manufacturers? Uh, uh, I think no. Sometimes uh, uh, they to uh, mm, they substitute substitute some words uh, and sometimes. Uh, they uh, write uh, not uh, every single ingredient. Yes, they write the improper in information. Sometimes the, in the information is lacking and we do not know the truth about the product that has been made. And uh, that's why it's very dangerous sometimes to buy the things that we do not know. Sometimes we know the producer, but the quality of uh, the product may have uh, much to be desired. Right? Without GMO, it's very <laughs> interesting. Genetically but, uh, modified objects. Sorry, I right? didn't never seen this, but nowadays in every product we can see not without GMO. Yes, exactly. I even saw a, a packet of salt 
with an inscription <laughs> without G M O. Right. It's, this is impossible because it is not genetically modified. So how can it be, right? But what can we do about it? It's our industry, right? The next question for you to, to answer is <clears throat> do you feel that it is that it has become easier or harder to find healthy foods at the supermarket? Mary, what's your point of view? Easy or hard to find a healthy food? Hard, healthy. Food. But if uh, if people very uh, very good know what uh, what uh, what what to buy, what, what to buy, it's not so hard. Mm -hmm. Some people who were abroad say that uh, food in the supermarkets in the United States is divided as to its its quality. They've got cheap and uh, modified uh, food and uh, uh, vegetables and fruits, and uh, we've got uh, fresh and uh, food of a uh, high quality. The products, the uh, um, ingredients that we use, but this kind of food is very expensive. So. Um. They wrote uh, that organic. Organic uh, food, yes. Mm -hmm. On the on the food they write that. Mm -hmm. So do you think yeah. that it is a good approach uh, to divide these two kinds of food, or is it better to mix everything in one? <laughs> what do you think? I think Mary? it's good to divide because how many men, so many men. Which. Uh, some persons didn't have a lot of money to buy, and they buy what they could. They can, right? But we uh, all always we must understand what kind of useful food or and what kind of not so useful. I agree. Thank you. Good of you. Where where yes. a lot of sugar or salt, or where not so lot of this ingredient. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, Mary, do you agree with Yuri? Uh, I, I, I don't, I don't know. Uh, if I you were in the supermarket and uh, you had the chance to see the food of a high quality and the food of a low quality, but very cheap, and uh, better one but very expensive, what sort of food would you choose? I think I choose quality food, but I uh, buy. Or buy vegetable, mm -hmm. example, mm, ne, ne, natural, 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 natural product in the market, not mm -hmm. super, not on the supermarket, not on the, not in the supermarket, right? Okay. So I uh, buy only some stuff that uh, which uh, quality, but no so expensive. Mm -hmm. I understand. Uh, golden middle. You choose the golden middle, right? Yes. <laughs> okay. Thank you for your answers. Question number three, Yuri. What do you think the responsibilities are food manufacturers? So, what do they? Uh, what should they tell us about the food, about the products they produce, and should they tell us something about it or not? Is it their responsibility to tell us about it? I you? think they must say they have to they have to write some information what ingredients they what uh, they include what is the date when they baked this product mm -hmm. and what uh, till what uh, date they go away when they still finish the date. The expiratory, expiratory date, yes? Expiratory date. The limit of the usage of the product should be also mentioned. And they must write truth. Truth. If they, if they, want, if they want the process by their product, and they have a lot of... Mm, Consumers, customers. Consumer, customs, yes. And visitors to their shops. They shows. must wrote the truth. Right, they must write the truth. Yes, exactly. I agree with you completely. Mike, what's your point of view about the uh, uh, manufacturers of food? 
what information should they give about the product? I think uh, uh, we have uh, we need to have uh, all the list of um, consistency. Ingredients. Huh? What? Ingredients. Uh, yes, uh, in, uh, ingredients in, uh, which uh, in which consists the product. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, a date, a date of production, and uh, how you say ex, uh, expiratory date. Expiratory uh, day, date. Expiratory uh, date. Could you write this also? Yes, just a minute. Uh, I think we need uh, to um, use uh, something like marker. Uh, what what uh, what is the quality of products? Because sometimes when uh, when you buy something, it's not eatable. I mean, uh, so, so some cheese. I don't know uh, how how it can <laughs> uh, how can make uh, products which uh, not uh, which not uh, uh, which are not similar. Yes, with the original, <laughs> it's hard to understand. Yes, I agree with you completely. Good. Okay, <coughs> and uh, here we have got some more practice about the food debate. So topic number one, governments should have the right to ban any food ingredients that may pose a health risk to the consumers. Yuri, do you agree? Yeah. You agree? Okay. What about you, Michael? Uh, what is the question? Yes. Yeah. Governments should have the right to ban any food ingredients that may pose a health risk to consumers. Mm, yes. Okay. Mary, what about you? Do you agree with this? Yes, I agree. And uh, I very disappointed when I'm very disappointed. I disappointed when in European, uh, European countries, countries? Uh, mm, no European countries European European countries European countries has no, no, no. European European yes. European okay. countries okay. has um, many bonded uh, have 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 been have, have, have banned many of them uh, many year <laughs> but in Kevin. our Good. Mm -hmm. in our country uh, we use it we, still, we are still using it yes I when, agree when i see i have a box which i handled my mother when she was younger my grandmother gets her uh, candy, and I see this European candy to work even yeah, concern. Mm -hmm. Yeah, concern. It was it was ninety was ninety five year, and it was concern. There were in, some con conservatives, conservatives. European products, yes. Okay, I understand. So maybe uh, nowadays they are not using it anymore, and uh, uh, they are using it less. So we do not know. But still, uh, uh, in our former USSR, we had uh, the products of a higher quality than we've got now. Do you agree, Yuri? Yes, I agree. And I, I think uh, juices were natural. Mm -hmm. And uh, milk was natural, and different products were very good. Yeah, I remember these times. No, but when I was little, I remember kefir, good uh, cheese, sour kefir, cream, oh, sour cream. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And <laughs> Yuri, how old are you? <laughs> I'm twenty-four. Twenty. Mm -hmm. So Anna, do you agree with Yuri? 
And what do you think about standards of quality of food? Are they okay now? Were they better in the past? Mm, I think yes. Um, uh, here in Russia, we have um, a very high quality standards uh, 10 years ago, but uh, after that, uh, these standards were cancelled at yes. all, and uh, we just have only technical recommendations to the uh, <coughs> uh, production of food. Yes. And uh, it's not very healthy, and food uh, became worst. At the worst. Yes. Yes. All meat has a chemical injections. Uh, it is very poor situation. Yes. So we've got the same situation in our country, unfortunately, and we can only hope that situation is going to change to to better sometime one day. I think. Uh, need uh, to, to see, in, in not, not only government, mm -hmm. to, uh, but uh, we have a lot of, uh, I, I don't know, of the, it's like chain of, of the shops, yes, big, it's very big chain, and uh, I think uh, they have a, a, maybe opportunity to, to and to find uh, more quality products which they sell. Mm -hmm. So it is their responsibility to produce and offer the products of higher quality to consumers, right? If it's not uh, their products, uh, they need to find the uh, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. We don't hear you, Michael. Okay, <laughs> I see. It's it's okay, okay. But sometimes producers um, want to uh, have less things to to produce and uh, to, <coughs> to to make it to, to have the cheaper ingredients and to sell it for a higher price. Anna, do you agree? Yes, of course. They're interested in a very cheap and. Uh, um, products when the, with a long uh, production uh, date. Circle? Circle? Yes, okay. yes. So they can uh, be more on shelves and uh, they do not throw it out after production date is, ex is expired. So they are very interested in the uh, consequence oh. and uh, chemicals to provide a, a good um, quality of food. Yes. That kind, that kind of quality that uh, will become food uh, more preserved. Mm -hmm. You're right. Thank you. I agree with you completely. So, Yuri, what do you think is more important for our business people nowadays? Profit or health of our consumers? Yes, for me, I think health. Health. Do you agree, Mary? Yes, I think it's uh, health very uh, more important because uh, if a company uh, will be uh, to do health food, we it's health food. Uh, health food. produce health food, it's a uh, very good uh, uh, influence for image this company and uh, this in and they have uh, profit uh, with the turnover, abroad turnover. Yes, yes. In the well, turnover, right? I think it's uh, nowadays it's not not natural juices because uh, this natural juice become a very high price when it was natural. Mm -hmm. Yes, I agree with you completely. So nowadays, uh, producers try to uh, produce uh, the low quality food, but our dream is for them to produce the food of a very high quality in order to keep and protect ourselves from danger. Well, Anna, do you agree? Yes. Yes, okay, good, thank you. Uh, here is the link for you to open. We've got some more vocabulary connected with our today's topic. Transfats vocabulary. Can you open it? Mm 
Mm -hmm. Good. So the first word is to avoid. Can you read the definition, Anna? You're welcome. Uh, to avoid is try to stay away from. What do you usually avoid when buying food? I avoid milk. I avoid without M. I avoid. I avoid milk and all lactose conserving products. Mm -hmm. Thank you, well done, good of you. Yuri, next one, bend. It's a verb. Bend, not allowed. Not allowed. So, what is not allowed to use in our uh, health, in our food industry as an ingredient in ready-made products? What we must not eat. What chips. is not allowed? What is banned? Chips, maybe. Coca-Cola chips. Yes. Crisps. Um, <laughs> yes. No, not chips, crisps. Crisps. Yes. Crisps. crisps. Yes. What is not allowed to to be to be used by the producers in our um, foodstuff uh, industry? So, do you know, Yuri? Not. Yes, you're right. So Not genetically bad. modified objects are banned to be used in our foodstuff industry. Do you agree? Yes. Okay, Mary, oh. next word. Uh, cholesterol. 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 Okay. The substance uh, present in substance. animal. The substance present in animal fat and tissues too much can lead to heart disease. Yes, diseases. Okay, yes. So, what do you think? What food stuff can, uh, contain cholesterol? No, it's not true. Cholesterol it's not uh, consists in product. Cholesterol it's our nash our mm -hmm. our. Uh, fat, but not fat. Mm, fat. <laughs> fat, but not uh, quality, and it need uh, for build our. It is necessary. It is, necessary. is it is it is necessary for build our to build our vessels. Sasudi, sasudi, right? But, but yes. there is information. It was different cholesterol. It's high level cholesterol and low level. Yes. It, it's Normal. not true. It's it's, it's true, true. true. My mother has a high cholesterol because she eats uh, a lot uh, of fat when she was younger. I see um, research. I uh, see one, uh, one person and uh, not one person in public medical, uh, medical. medicine. Pub, medicine. No, not not pub. Medical. Pub meat. Pub meat site. A colored site. And uh, when our uh, sasudi vessels vessels uh, broken uh, have are broken. Uh, are broken are broken and uh, it need to fix it and uh, it needs repairing it needs repairing they, they need repairing they need repairing okay. and uh, fat fat must do that, uh, fat must must to to about two <laughs> I can't say any, no, anything. No, it's okay. It's okay, right? Uh, fat uh, need to repair our vessels. Yes, right. Fat is needed to repair our vessels. Yeah. And uh, in right. this and and this. Uh, place mm -hmm. formulated uh, not uh, when it's very big problem formulated uh, big like plomba <laughs> and uh, clock right clock yes and uh, now it's um, call it um, like cholesterol cellulite uh, but uh, problem not fat problem with vessels mm -hmm. so people the must have is not in fat the yes. problem is in vessels vessels yes thank you for your research and I know for that being so uh, well known uh, about it Frank, uh, he or she Frank your 
he or she put frying uh, very a lot. It was a high cholesterol. High cholesterol. When when the person uh, eat a fried food. Yes, I know. There are lots of terms today. We are trying to uh, talk about uh, some professional topics, but <laughs> it is not so very easy for us to do, I understand. So, uh, first of all, we have to state in our mind what we have to say in Russian or in Ukrainian, and then choose the words that we know to make our sentences correct. So, it is not so very easy, but uh, you are doing okay. And I hope that everything is going to be fine. So, Anna, do you agree with Mary about this situation? Yes, I, uh, I've read this article too. It was several years ago. And I think the uh, article you give us today is uh, more old. Is older. Older, older. yeah. So, um, it's like not a very fresh data, data on it. Um, some trans fats uh, or s some cholesterol is good for our health because mm -hmm. they need to, to repair our vessels. Uh, it's, it's, it's true. And Yuri said about high cholesterol in the <coughs> blood, uh, it's not a bad thing. Mm -hmm. Yes, of course, uh, eating only fried food uh, is a bad thing for our body, but high cholesterol is not always a um, uh, sign of some disease. But I read, uh, I know some persons which have high cholesterol is ab above uh, 10 degrees and uh, it, she has a lot of problems with heart. I cannot hear you, Yuri. Maybe it's a bad sound. problem with vessels. With vessels. Vessels. With heart and uh, with, uh, she has a good blush in the glass with she. Mm -hmm. Ice, with ice. <laughs> yes, he has problems with eyes. Problems with eyes. Yeah. With eyes, I understand. Okay. It's, so it's not normal. Normal cholesterol. No, it may be from four to five to five. Normal from four point. So it is still an object for discussion for the scientists, and uh, maybe in future this problem is going to be solved. And uh, people who uh, who are going to sell uh, to solve this problem uh, will uh, will be much appreciated by public because it is very urgent problem for all the people and for our health. But let's not uh, go so very deep in this research and try to uh, go back to learning English for today's class. And uh, to our handout, we've got another word. This is detail. So what is detail? It's a verb. Maria, you're welcome, Mary. Uh, the detail is uh, described in full. Describe in full, yes. We have just detailed uh, the cholesterol and its importance in our bodies, right? The next word is diet. Yuri, what is diet. it? It's a noun. Uh, mm -hmm. it's what a person chooses to eat. Mm -hmm. Have you ever kept to the diet in your life? Yuri? Yes, when I uh, mm -hmm. when I was poisoned. When I was poisoned. You kept I to the kept. diet. How long? For how long time did you keep to the diet? Uh, I two weeks. For two weeks. Yeah. Or it was two weeks ago. Two weeks. Not ago, but two weeks. You have been keeping to a diet for two weeks, am I right? It's in, in the last year. Mm -hmm. And was it useful to you? Did it help? Yes, I think uh, sometimes we must to eat a diet. We must eat without, without to. We must eat. Because it's useful. It is useful health. for our health. Mm -hmm. what, so we, what, what does your diet consist of? Maybe a lot of vegetables, mm -hmm. olive oil. Mm -hmm. Uh, rice, some and, rice, atornoya riba, atornoya Yes. <coughs> Boiled meat and uh, fish, right? Yes. Stewed meat and stewed fish. Fish. Okay. 
And did you like this diet? This diet was it difficult for you to keep to that kind of diet? No. I understand. Good, Mary. What about you? Have you ever kept a diet in your life? No, <laughs> I never keep diet. What do you no, think maybe about mm -hmm. I I not eat meat. Mm -hmm. I don't I, eat. Yeah. You are a vegetarian. I don't eat. Yes. Mm -hmm. So, do you think that uh, being a vegetarian helps you in life? Do you yes. have Do you think that you have got less problems than the others? You spend you spend not so much money, yeah. <laughs> it helps, Oksana. It helps. <laughs> no, you uh, are you see how much banana cost now? So yes, bananas are rather expensive nowadays, and, uh, but the cheaper and, uh, the the meat is is and, more expensive. Right. Mushroom, 50 grivnos for <laughs> kilogram. It's impossible. Impossible. <laughs> Absolutely. And I think mushroom is very difficult for our health. It's very super Hard to digest. I don't Hard think to so. digest. Maybe it depends on the mushroom. Yuri, Yuri, you know it's only if it's muhammad. <laughs> <laughs> As for me, I'm not prefer mushrooms. You don't like it? You don't yeah, like Aksana, mushrooms? How do, how, like. how do you say mushrooms or mushrooms? Mushrooms. Mushrooms. Muhammad, it's a fly. Mushrooms. Oh no. Fly? Yes. Let's check. Let's find it in the dictionary. Okay. Mushrooms. Yeah. Because I Muhammad. think it's mushrooms. Mushroom, oh, mushrooms. mushrooms, it is for sure. Okay, and uh, Yuri, can you help me? Mushroom. Mm -hmm. Muhammad in English is? Mushrooms, это вот я сейчас напишу, как вот простые. Ой, то, что надо, копировать. Amanita? Yes, Amanita, I guess. Mm, I, uh, no, I no, I, I, I remember it fly a girl. A girl. Yes, mm. uh, I meet many uh, tra uh, translators' word. Mm -hmm. Yes, there are many oh. words. Yes. Fly, fly agaric. Mm -hmm. Я не то скопила, что хотела просто не ту ссылку. It's okay about the cholesterol. Fly agaric. Yes, I, I've got it. Good. So uh, you see that there are different words that translate this meaning, and uh, yes, we'll have one. Fly, fly agaric это мухомор, да? Yes, yes. Good. <coughs> so what is the general conclusion that we can draw from today's class, Mary, about trans fats? Uh, Are they don't. useful or not? Are they useful for our health or not? Not useful because They're not useful. because it's uh, they because they are I I forgot words dangerous they not, are dangerous not, not I won't say artif artificial. artificial artificial they are not natural but artificial so that's why they are not useful for our health they. It have a, a spiral left and uh, something. I Anna, do you have a call? Someone is calling. Yes. A ring. I see. I hear a ring. Here is the uh, ring. Yes, uh, you're right. Yuri, so what is the conclusion of today's class? About must, trans fats. Uh, what should we do with it? We must choose not uh, with them. From not food to transfer, not mm -hmm. transfer food, non transfer. You have to choose the natural kinds of food. Yes. And it is going to be okay for our health. Anna, what about you? So, what uh, conclusion can you draw from today's class? Well, Anna have a trouble with the sound. Because it's okay. Okay. Mike, you what's your there. point of view? Mm -hmm. What's your point lesson? of view about trans fats? What's we your need idea to write it. We, we, we write this uh, uh, be, uh, 
<laughs> big letters on the product. Uh, using not the use big that. letters in the product. Okay, I understand. Good. So thank you for your participation and discussion in today's class. I welcome you to my future classes and bye for now. Thank you. Bye bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye.